this book has been so special. It, it, it was released in 2003, and I have made props from this book, Frog Belly Rat Bones, Giant Underpants. I bring them to schools when I, when I give talks to the schools, and I read this book at the end of the talk, and I can't wait to that part where I pull them out of this big Frog Belly Rat Bone box, and the kids just every time so far, knock on, knock on wood, uh, that, that, that'll always bring laughter. And I made the crown, and um, also since then, there's been uh, a few places that have contacted me that are puppeteers and everything. They, they, they found the book and said, oh, we'd love to do this for, a, for different stage plays and puppet shows and everything. And um, one of them is uh, the Rogue Artist Ensemble in Los Angeles. They, uh, oh, just a group of wonderful artists, they said they were looking for new material and um, they were in a bookstore and came across Frogly Rapone and they put together this huge box filled with flowers and butterflies and a handwritten scroll like this long and they sent it to Candlewick Press. So they called me in and, and um, every time they call me, it's always good news over there, I just love it. So they bring me this room and there's this huge box and they said, go ahead and open it. I was like, what is this? No clue. And they said, read this first big manuscript and it was, it was explaining who they were, this rogue artist ensemble, and how they found Frog Belly looking for new material and they were just, they asked so nicely and they were so excited to see if I would mind if they did a play. And I was like, oh, I would love it. So they sent the manuscript and everything and it just, it was wonderful and they flew me out to see the play at the, uh, at the uh, Los Angeles Times uh, Book Festival and um, at UCLA. And to watch my characters just dancing around on stage and hearing, they, they had songs that came with it, everything. It, it was just, it was amazing. It was surreal. I mean, my hairs were sticking up my arms and I, I was just like, this is so fun. Um, so this little guy has had so much life and I hope it just keeps going and going and going. It's just a, such a great little story.